Hello, Samir. How are you all? Welcome back to another video. Guys, in this video, we're going to learn what is JSON dot parse. Why do we parse a JSON? And what is the use when we parse it? So, without any further ado, let's start the video. So now guys I have created a file called json parse.js so I have created let object equal to so I will give this quotations in this whatever you write it's a it will be considered a string so I will write an employee object so I will write employee now in that employee I can give the employee attributes so I will write first will be the name so I will write name as a B C now after that I'll write salary I'll write salary of this particular employee I'll write one two three in the uh, double quotes or you can give a salary as an integer not an issue and now I'll write uh, his uh, roll number so it's now normally we can write anywhere so roll number I'll write 65 something like that so now first of all uh, if I want to access this object let's say I'll write console dot log I'll write okay obj dot employee dot um, I want to know the salary of the employee so if I write like this what will happen so now uh, let me run this json parse.js so it will directly throw me an error so it will say cannot read properties of undefined so this is not an object it is directly considering as a string so what we can do why we use json.parse so in this particular situation we can use it so I'll write let past parse json so I'll write past json equal to so json dot if I put dot so these are the methods pass we have stringify we have so we'll you we'll see the pass now what I want to pass so you can pass to that pass string also so I'll write obj so I want to exactly pass obj so now so if I pass this if I write pass json dot employee salary let us see what will be the answer for that so if I execute this now I will get it as a 1 2 3 so instead of salary if we want something else uh, let's say I want a name so if I execute this so I will get a name ABC so what if I need a role serial number so if I execute this so I will get a serial number so this JSON dot parse will parse the particular JSON into readable object format of a JavaScript so that we can utilize JavaScript object, we can easily access the attributes. So this is a simple JSON dot pass example. Hope you would have liked the video. If you like the video, guys, please click on like. If you're a new viewer, please click on subscribe. Till then, guys, take care. Have a great day. Bye bye.